Hey, if you're like me, you're excited about this week's weekly check-in. Now, happy Pentecost week. We just celebrated the Feast of Pentecost. It means Easter season is officially over. Um, and speaking of things being over, our academic year is coming to an end. So congratulations to all of our students and teachers and faculties right here at our St. Thomas Aquinas Catholic grade school. Amazing year, as well as to St. John Paul II High School and their first graduating class. That's uh, amazing. Hey, you got to know this. This is the key thing I want you to know this week. 12.30 p.m. Sunday Mass is continuing. We started in Lent. It was a big hit. And uh, we're going to keep it going. 12.30 p.m. Mass. Uh, it's a beautiful Mass. If you are going to the other Masses or looking and they're getting a little too full for you, or you're looking for to get back to church and you're looking for Mass that has a little bit more elbow room, 12.30 p.m. Mass. Spread the word. It's a great Mass. Great time of day. You can sleep in a little bit. Glorious. Now, um, so that's the main thing, but also all sorts of other wonderful things. Here's a little save the date for you. We're doing a volunteer appreciation Sunday, June 6th. And uh, it's basically any Sunday mass, including Saturday night. We're gonna be doing some special, well, I don't wanna tell you all the details. It's a surprise. So whatever mass you come to, Saturday night, 9, 7, 1045, 1230 p.m., we're gonna have some special volunteer uh, surprises for you. So um, come to that and I think you'll find it a blessing. Just want to express my appreciation for each and every person who volunteers time, big or small, right here at Thomas Aquinas because we depend on you to help us do what we do. So June 6th slash, May, slash the 5th, but it's the weekend of the 5th and the 6th of June. Hey, this coming Monday is Memorial Day, so let's remember and pray for all those who have given their lives in service of our country. And we will uh, be closed as, at the office on that Monday, including the dock and the gift shop uh, back open on Tuesday. Also, we're moving into summer hours at the dock. Just basically remember this, no afternoons. You know why it's too hot in the summertime? You don't wanna be going to get a hot coffee on in the middle of the summer in the afternoon, but the morning's still open at the dock, moving into summer hours there. Also, the Knights of Columbus are sponsoring a blood drive this Sunday, Memorial Day weekend. Also, it's Trinity Sunday, so um, feel free to uh, do that. The uh, Blood Mobile is gonna be here between 7.45 in the morning and 12.30. So you wanna donate some blood, uh, do that. All donors will receive a Vitalent hat, and you'll be also entered into a drawing for a, van, a brand new Volkswagen. So that's cool. What else? I'm getting my uh, weekly Bible study scriptural exploration. It's digital, you can check it out. I have the information in this email for that. It's a little deep dive into the scriptures that we can do together. So check that out. Catholic Breakfast coming back for season four, starting later in June. And um, some information on a, a CDA matching gift opportunity. Even though we've, we've accomplished our goal, there's so much more that we can still do to support the uh, charity and development appeal here in the Diocese of Phoenix. More info on that down below. Everybody, happy Pentecost. Here comes Trinity Sunday. And let's, uh, you know what I'm excited about this coming Sunday in terms of preaching? It's, um, I, you'll, you'll see in, in my uh, letter, just I'm interested in taking a look at the Blessed Virgin Mary as the great example of how to live Trinitarian life. She shows us how the Trinity is not just an idea, it's the central mystery of our faith, and she shows us how to live that in our daily lives. So God bless you, and we'll see you soon.